Hey you, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today I am flipping through my holiday slash winter sticker albums. This is where I keep all my specific holiday related stickers and foil overlays and foil things. Um, obviously I already did on my channel a Halloween version, um, which will be, it wasn't too many videos ago, <laughs> but um, yeah, so I did Halloween autumn one and so I have a winter Christmas one. I don't bother with summer, spring because there isn't really like big holidays that I do weeks and weeks on end. They're just sort of in my normal um, everyday sticker collection. So let's get through my holiday stickers. Now I've got um, this Sadie stickers album here. I just thought it'd be perfect for this because these bows are like so Christmassy. Um, she's got the gold bow on the side and foil. So I just got it in gold. You can get it in other foils. Um, I'm not sure if it's still up in her shop, but I thought this would be perfect for the season. And this is the large size. That's so I can fit um, bottom while she's in. So let's go through it. First of all, I have my two, or is it, yeah, my two bucket lists. I'll just show you all the stickers that I have. Because um, it might as well be a collection video since I've already organized it. But this one is from Scribble Prints Co. and this is the winter bucket list. So it's play in the snow, build a snowman, things like that. I just have them in all four foils. I don't think I'd be using um, rose gold, but you never know. Then this one is an older one. This is a Christmas, I think this is from last year. Um, so I've used some of them, but a Christmas bucket list. Um, so I've already got used like holiday shopping and stuff from the send holiday cards, Hallmark movie binge. So I just got those not in rose gold because you know I don't really use rose gold in this time, but sometimes I just select all three, you know. Then here are some Scribble Prince Co. movie scripts, also from last year. So obviously I've used some, but yeah. Lots of cute Christmas movies on here. Then we've got ones that I made myself um, when I could foil and I still have almost entire sheets so with black as well. So keeping these, I just sort of like thematic scripts with some extra movies that I really like like Arthur Christmas. Uh, Arthur Christmas. Definitely one of my faves. <laughs> um, let's see if we can go. Here we go. So first we have here, I'm trying to get all my winter stuff first. Then Christmas and then Valentine's. So we just got a winter decorations or deco set from Once My Love. She recently re-released re this. Then I have an old paper shy um, Nana in the Snow. And some old um, Scribble Prince Go Celeste, um, well, Celeste, but Scribbles in snowy outfits and making snowmen. I've got some cold weather outfits um, both times. I think this is the older one, and this is the newer one. Um, but these are all pre previously released, but I do like to throw these in when it's cold. Um, I got some festive jars. I just think those are fun. I really love using the ones with the snowflakes in them. So those are like the most used ones um, to mark like snowy stuff or winter things. So whereas the other red ones are more Christmassy to me. And then we have more old paper shy Christmas me time. Just some relaxing things there. And then we have these little um, foiled mittens from Simply Watercolor Co. And these ice cube munchkins from Once More With Love. Um, and then we have a newer, this is a newer paper shy um, sheet, Vanilla Snow Day. Love these, so adorable. And then I just have some black scripts from Randy Dub Plans, Gingerbread Latte, which we've already, um, and I got some for paper and milk, we've already cracked open the gingerbread um, syrup for our coffees, so, so yum. We have some Fox and Cactus wintry um, coffee girls, which I've used a lot of in this colorway. And then ones in the usual colorway in the um, poppy. Then I have some festive, 
festive drink machines. So that'd be fun to mug um, doing a new pot of coffee or something while drinking a lot of coffee that day. And then we have festive cupcakes and festive hot drinks. I think these were both from last year. So they're slightly bigger than her stickers now. And then this was a 20 pound freebie at the time. Just lots of uh, festive drinks. And then we have this Christmas coffee pot. Yeah, this is the kind of coffee pot I actually have. But this stick is probably too big, which is a bit disappointing. <laughs> um, we got paper and milk holiday drinks and holiday coffee. And these are great because the snowflake and the penguin one is still really good for winter. So I like those. And then we have Christmas coffee time from Hello Petite Paper. Use a ton of them. And then some older paper shower Christmas drinks. Lots of Christmas drinks. <laughs> We've got some Hello Petite Paper winter Christmas treat, uh, winter coffee times, which I love this sheet as well. And then we have some Christmas girls from Fox and Cactus. She has a pastel version and not like a bright proper version. So this is the pastel um, laptop and here's a bright laptop. Planning and planning. And then this is just a normal study time from Hello Beauty Paper but the colors go pretty well for winter. And then we have the study, study time Christmas which I love those plaids and reds. Then we have Baby It's Cold Outside mini just like a couple looking outside at the snow and then a movie time instead. And then we have Holidays With You, which I didn't use any of this sheet, um, surprisingly, but I will break these in this year. It's super cute. And then I have a Christmas couple from Paper Shire. I just did Lux hair as pink, because I thought that kind of made up for the gender, not being so gender neutral. Um, and then, plus they had pink hair for a while. <laughs> Then these are the Fox and Cactus Christmas Cats, really adorable. And then we have Vanilla Winter Couples, so these are sort of the couple-y ones all together. So these are more generic winter vanilla couples, and I love these because they're also pretty gender neutral. Just one, one um, bunny is taller than the other. <laughs> then we have April Showers Rainy Day, but it also rains a lot in winter here as well doesn't always snow. <laughs> and then we have Baking Holiday from Paper and Milk. Um, and hopefully going to do some more baking this year. I didn't do too much last year. And then we have Fox and Cactus Little Christmas Cats. Definitely some of my favorite. <laughs> we have Holiday Desserts. These are all super old from Paper and Milk. But hopefully she'll re-release some of these. And then we have Ginger Cookies from Paper Shire. And some um, really old cupcakes as well. Then we have holiday cakes from Paper and Milk, which I love these, plus the snowman ones. Um, and the Christmas cake, like the Japanese tradition, really cool. Then we have a baking unicorn from Fox and Cactus, making gingerbread house and just baking and cookies. You have these Christmas TV um, things. I don't use them a lot. I actually find... Fox and Cactus's Christmas palette too bright, like the green especially, um, but I still make use of them. And then I have Most Most Loves holiday card writing. I don't think I'll bother doing cards because right now it's probably probably even too late to mail them out um, because mail is just nuts at the moment. But then I have the Happy Mail and I love these for when mail gets delivered. We have Christmas mail from Paper Shire and Cat Hairs. <laughs> um, these are really big though. But these are a little bit better size festive gifts and they're like boxes. And then we also have a 30 pound freebie which has more of those jars in it as well as lots of gifts and bows and things. And then we have a different happy hol holiday happy mail. This is like big boxes and stuff. Like proper Christmas. Whereas this is more like cards. This is like the new version. And then we have holiday gifts and cards. We're not doing holiday gifts this year. We haven't done it for a couple of years because we mostly just like make good food. <laughs> and that's like our holiday um, presents to each other. So we don't really wrap gifts or anything. But 
don't know, I still have them for whenever. Then we have holiday shopping. So once again, I probably won't be doing this either. <laughs> then we have Christmas presents. Well, I do have to get, probably get some digital or other presents. Then we have Christmas presents from a super old paper shire. Then we have some winter reading from Fox and Cactus. And a different version of those girls. Because I thought they went with holiday spreads. And then some books. So we're sort of in the book area now. <laughs> some Christmas reading girls. And then these are sort of like the characters or um, miscellaneous. So we've got some um, elf munchkins. <laughs> so cute. I love how Buddy the Elf is so soft and squishy. And we have ugly sweaters. We have Grinch. <laughs> Grinchkin. So cute. And then we have like sexy Grinch from <laughs> Fox and Cactus in his lederhosen. Um, and then we just have some, like, random characters here from Paper and Milk and some reindeer girls where she's giving the bird for when it's Christmas but you want to be sassy. It's just some holiday characters from um, Once More With Love. And this is a 40 pound freebie from Paper Shy, which is like half boxes and dividers and stuff and sometimes I do like to decorate and use bigger boxes as you can see here. So we've got a bunch of those dividers and things here. Super cute. I definitely want to pull in a few more of these, like the gingerbread and the icicles. And they have sort of more half boxes and shelves and uh, like plates and stuff. Really perfect to put like a foil script over. Then we have some holiday deco, which I don't have very much of that left. Or do I have a second? I'll have a new one of it. But obviously I've used some on that one, so I need to like use up this sheet first. <laughs> so I put it in front. Then we have some Celeste from Scribble Prince Co. You can't get them anymore. Uh, so Fox and Cat just like mixed sheets. And I've almost used up all these foxes. I think I liked these ones a little bit more because they mostly were wearing light blue, which I feel like went with more spreads. Then we have a bucket list. That's super cute. I should drink, try and use some more of these. Now these are all the sort of bucket list ones here as well. We got one here from Hello Petite Paper. I really love her Christmas stuff. I know it's really soft and pretty. Then we have some samplers from Now Paper Shire. All of these mince mince pies. I actually have some this year, so exciting. And then this is from Paper Princess Plans, who's now in Kiara's planner. <laughs> Um, I still have this, so I'm gonna keep it. And then we have some winter candles, just nice for doing like homey things. We have a countdown from one ton million. I think I got this like in a grab bag kind of thing. And then we have some Valentine's Day right at the back because that's counted in winter for me. So love is in the air from Once More with Love. I think these will be go perfect with my Be Mine art set. So if you picked up. A version of Be Mine, these would be perfect. I I don't know if they're in the shop, but she'll probably re-release it. Then we have some Scribblers as a sampler, and also these Paper Milk Mario and Love, which are so adorable. <laughs> so that is everything in there, and I got my overlays in the back. So in the back here, I've got my two um, Snowflake um, Wiggle Sets bundles from Scribble Prints Co. You can find them as a whole bundle and you can get them in gold as well. I decided to just keep them in one go because I'll probably use a whole bundle. And then last year she had these like sampler sheets of snowflakes so I still have a silver and a hollow one left. Um, I've got some little tree date dots from Simply Watercolor Co. I don't think I have any other date dots in there. No, I have my usual silver, gold, and hollow. Then these are my date covers. So these new snowflake ones from Sadie Stickers. I didn't get gold. I know, sometimes I get gold and sometimes I don't. Then from last year from Simply Watercolor Co, I've got a whole bunch of these little peppermints and candy canes. Um, and I just got a few in each foil just to like... There's the other gold one. I've used one lot of peppermint. <laughs> um, 
But yeah, those are my special um, headers. And I tend to use them just over one set of the glitter headers. I don't tend to do them over the whole spread. And then I have some normal head overlays in the from Planet Choco. Um, I didn't buy from her this year just because she's in South Korea, I believe, and you know, male. Um, but I still have some of these leftover snowflake confetti head overlays. And then we have some bottom washies. So we have some snowflakes, some 15 millimeter, and also full size from Sadie's stickers. Then last year she had these bigger snowflakes. They still have them. And then Simply Watercolor Co. had some sweater ones and some candy canes. So I still have a couple of those as well. Um, now we have some full boxes, and I separated the quotes from the um, designs and not all of these are simply watercolor code. The snow is falling one is but this will you be my valentine is from a school prince code freebie from last year so I just put them on these put them together in these sheets so they wouldn't just be a single box floating around. So these two are also simply watercolor code. I love the happy christmas because that's more the British thing to say rather than merry christmas. And then it's the most wonderful time of the year, Mary Bright from Scribble Prince Co. And then these two are from um, the Sticky Committee. <laughs> I used to have them in older, um, smaller things, so I had to cut off the sides for them to fit, but they fit in this bigger sticker album. And then I have some more designy full boxes. So you have some sweater patterns from last year from Simply Watercolor Co. These were new um, snowflake ones from CD Stickers. Then Planner Choco snowflakes. Just a bunch of snowflake designs. Um, these Hello Pretty paper overlays. I just thought these, like, bob, these bows would be cute. It's like a present kind of thing. These are some um, leftover Scribble Prints Co. And then some more of the sweater one, but has like the sweater weather and stuff um, available. So that is everything in my winter holiday album. I've got a little room to grow. I have some more um, foil coming in. Very little room. <laughs> um, some like New Year's foil and some more Christmas foil. But I thought I'd get this video out for you guys um, so you can see how I'm putting together my holiday and winter stickers. Uh, so let me know what do you do with your seasonal stuff. Have you moved into their own albums? Because um, a few people have done it now like Andrea and um, Lauren. But yeah, let me know what you do. And otherwise, I hope you like this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you next time. Bye.